Greetings, everyone, and thank you for coming to another uh, video on this YouTube channel. Today, uh, I'm going to review something that I've been uh, waiting for a few for a few weeks, probably, um, to, to arrive here uh, where I live right now. And um, so, just to, to put you in a quick uh, in a quick perspective, right, of what what's happening, what what is all of this. Um, recently, uh, I, I started working more with the uh, with a more corporate laptop versus my my own computer, where where, where I have it. Um, it's very powerful, so I've been running there heavy um, heavy tasks, you know, heavy heavy programs, especially you know GPU GPU oriented um, programs. So. Uh, but recently, I received a very nice laptop from uh, from the place I'm uh, I'm working uh, currently, uh, with a proper Nvidia GPU and so on. So uh, it, it was the, the right time to 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 switch to um uh to switch to a, to a proper corporate computer um to 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 do uh, to do those those heavy tasks within uh, with, with the GPU. Uh, the only problem that I had with that is that um, so when you want to switch back and forth uh, or if you have like a um, like an Xbox or PlayStation Five or any other uh, any other um, thing that requires HDMI. Then you will need to uh, keep changing uh, the, the cables and, and and so on, right? Or or even the screen sometimes, and it can be really um, really tricky. Or for example, right like right now, like right now, uh, it's already you know it's 10, 15 p.m. here my time, right? And if I wanted to record something uh, for this YouTube channel, something about open source technologies or anything, right, right, that I uh, that I review over here, like today, um, I will need to disconnect everything, you know, uh, connect the, the the screens back to the to the uh, to the main uh, CPU that I have here, uh, not the main, but the personal CPU. So what I order is, of course, you guess it already, is a KVM, right? That's nothing exciting about a KVM. Uh, probably you've been using them for for quite a long time. Um, I remember using them more into for the, um, the, the the professional ones inside the rack right that you just pull it the pull it the tray and then you can you could switch there between uh, all the kvms you know that they were they were connected to the um uh, to the back of the servers so but that is why i'm excited uh, i'm excited about this product right because this product it is probably a mix you know between like a very end user consumer with two uh kvms you know uh, for two uh, for two cpus or for two entries right hdmi and uh usbs and so on and between that 19 uh, you know inches inches rack you know more professional one this one it has four um you you can see here it's very very heavy let me see if you can see it there you go so this is the uh, the KVM that I received today after a few weeks waiting. Can you see it over there? Um, I ordered it in uh, tsmart.com. Um, I ordered it on the uh, Europe um, shop. Um, so that is why it took some time to arrive directly. Uh, they, they told me that the warehouse is in China, uh, but I thought it was coming from from Germany because uh, all the website it's in is in German. Um, with translation there in English, or you can just go and select English. But then later on, the invoices and everything it just came from, from uh, you know, from a German company. But anyways, uh, nevertheless, it arrived. It, it took some time. Versus in Amazon, you can order it the same models in Amazon. It's just that in Amazon, it's a bit. Uh, I found it a bit more expensive. You know, um, like like quite quite a big difference to just to order it in Amazon. But the benefit to order it in Amazon is that they had immediate uh, availability so let's i have not opened it i just uh, took it out of the box and i decided like hey let's do let's do a review um just in case that uh, you know it helps someone someone in the channel someone that um it's needy it, it, it's in the need of something something like 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 i do um i do not have any video game uh, that i will uh, so, so i can connect that uh so you will see i don't have any 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 like that but well, uh, I will connect my my main my main uh, PC, and I will connect as well the laptop PC, and I, I, I'll I'll show you maybe some some pictures later on or some small uh, small video after I finish all of that. But okay, let's let's open it right now. Um, 
let's let's open it over here. It is very very nice. Ooh, it came here with a very nice note. Like uh, enjoy. I would like to thank. Uh, I would like to thank awesome customers like you for your amazing support. You rock. If you come across any other technical issue, please go to support.tsmart.com. Mars CEO. That is a very nice, very very nice uh, detail over here. You know, just uh, uh, some words that you open the box, and that is that is what what it already resonates. Um, so yeah, it came here with a with a manual. It's in English, so that is that is very very nice. Oh, by the way, the T the the T the T smart uh, or T smart like it, like is like is here. Uh, it 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 came from Tesla Elect technology, right? That is that is very curious. Um, okay, well, I'm not going to look much into the uh, into the manual right now, right? That, that we can take a look later on. I'll show you right now. It's very very heavy, but let me see if I can uh, show you how it came. Uh, you know, with the packaging. So this is what it comes, uh, and let me take the plastics out. Well, there's no plastic. There is like a like some some foam to protect the to protect it. It's very nice. It's very 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 sturdy. I, I, I like it. I like it. Um, so yeah, you can see that it has uh, it has uh, dual HDMI, 4K, 60 Hz, 444. So I can connect up to four um, up to four different computers to uh, to two uh, screens. So that is what I actually have. That's the setup I have. I don't have anything else. I don't have three screens or four screens or nothing like that. I have two screens. I'm expecting to be with two screens for a long, long time. Um, so, uh, but what I, what it might change is the amount of um, devices that I will connect. So that is why this uh, KVM it's is perfect for me, right? So um, let me see if I can tell you the exact model as well. Should come over here. Yes. So the the exact model is HKS four zero two P twenty three. So that is the specific model. And if I show you over here, these are I don't know if it's going to focus the camera. Probably not. It's focusing me more. Um, but yeah. Well, anyways, uh, I'll I'm going to to take a quick look and I I'll explain it to you. Right. So. That's the 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 plug over here, right? The uh, the juice. We need to connect this to the uh, to the power supply. Then we have here. Uh, I can see the, there are two USB 3.0 over here. Uh, this is where you connect the mouse and keyboard. It seems like USB 2.0. I might try to connect my keyboard over here, but we'll see. It's just that my keyboard it has as well um, like an USB hub as well in inside the. Um, the keyboard itself. So when I try to connect something, something quick like a USB or something, I always use the, the the keyboard instead of going, you know, behind the computer and and so on, right? And then it has, uh, well, PC one, PC two, PC three, or PC four. It says PC, but it can be anything, right? So I've been seeing some other videos, some other reviews where people connect here the uh, the. Uh, even, even the Nintendo Switch, I think I saw the the review. So that that could be very interesting to take a look. Um, on, 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 on all of that. And then it has uh, output A, output B, and that, that is about it, you know, on the back. Uh, nothing nothing more special than that. And then on the front, on the front is very, very nice. Um, it reminds me like a kind of like, a, what what are those calls? Like a, the, the black magic, you know, the, the ones that, uh, that you can just switch between, uh, between the screens and everything. Um, so well, it's very nice. You can just select the the different models, uh, the different PCs over here. I saw some modes that you can just have like a PC one or a screen one, PC two and a screen two, and then you can just move the mouse between them. Uh, that's that's crazy, right? So I'll I'll take a look later on of how that works and everything. Very excited to see um, to see to see that happening. Um, what else? It has like a small LED screen over here. Um, I just saw it on the videos, but uh, I don't know. I have not tested just yet. Again, this is the first the first time I'm I'm opening this. It has a very nice USB USB uh, USB C over here. USB 3.0 USB C over here. Very nice. Um, so far, it's again. It feels very, 
you know, like very heavy, something that that it worth the money already, right? Um, either that or old, but no, no, I, I'm just joking. It feels absolutely fantastic. So let's see, there's maybe something else on the box and that's what I'm going to discover right now. Uh, okay, I'm expecting that it will be some of the cables, right? Because if not, I will have problems to connect uh, all of this. So let's see, because I ordered the UK power supply. So that is always a bit tricky with um, uh, when you order something something from from Europe. So let's see. Oh, by the way, this ca you can rack this on a, on, on, on a rack already. It came with the uh, with little pieces, so you can just put it on the on the rack. That's very nice. Not today. Uh, I don't have the rack here. It's uh, in another place. Oh yes, very nice, very nice. So two things. First is the small um, remote, so you can just switch it from here. But because I'm going to have this just in front of me, I prefer just to click uh, to click these great buttons. But it's good. Yeah, it's a remote over there. And yes, thank God. It comes with an UK power supply, so that is thumbs up um, because sometimes you need to, you know, uh, open a support ticket and say like, uh, you know, I live in the UK, you ship it to the UK, blah blah blah. But not in this, not this time. So that's that's very nice. Uh, it asks right when you were ordering the good the good thing about ordering. Well, if you order in the in the Amazon.co.uk, that will be UK plug, 100% sure. Um, but when you order through the website, uh, this e Europe German website that it has uh, some English translation, you can order like uh, the, the plug, uh, Europe plug or UK plug. So I guess I guess they are selling a lot of things here in the UK because if not, you are not going to even bother for uh, with 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 having a different um, different cable. Let's take a look here, and this is the main. Let me show you. So this might be the same the, the, the big. Uh, the main box with all of the cables. Yes, there it is. Um, so the cables that it came, it's uh, it came like a 4K HDMI over here. So that is one. I'm expecting four, right? One that is. This is one of the KVM cables. So this KVM cable, it came already with uh, USB 3.0 uh, with the USB. Um, I don't even know how to how to call this, uh, but but, uh, but one of the one of the bigger ones that is going to connect in uh, to the uh, to the to the back of the KVM over here, um, and then let's see what else. I have another one here, so I'm expecting just just four and four most likely, right? Or at least four KVMs and two HDMI's, because that is uh, this may be for the two monitors, right? The normal. Um, the, the normal HDMI's and this might be for all of the KVMs, right? So yeah, another KVM cable, another KVM cable, yes. And well, a third HDMI, so that is nice that it it came with three uh, three HD, three HDMI's uh, over here. So that is that is nice. And then here it came with. Let me take a look. What is this? Uh, I will need to read the instructions. It seems to me it's, it's like a, it has a jack. Uh, it may be like for the remote controller, perhaps, um, most likely. But I'll take a look later on. Uh, I can I can see it over here. External IR. I'll need to look at the instructions. Um, I don't know what this uh, what this jack with this uh, infrared IR, right? Like a uh, yeah, infrared. So I, I guess this infrared is just for the for the remote, but because I'm not going to use the remote, I do not. I I think I don't I, I don't I don't need it. Okay. Uh, well, that is very nice. I think uh, what I'm going to do right now, um, because this is all very exciting, right? Probably it's the first time I'm doing like an opening, unboxing, and all that stuff with you. Um, I saw you before some super micros, but I have I have it here already, and we were trying to uh, to, to to discuss while while I was showing. Um, I think I'm going to um, take a take a stop here. You know, take a, pow a pause. I will put everything together here on a table. I'll take a great picture of uh, all the material that it came, um, and then I'll I'll try to. If I have something interesting while I'm mounting it, I'll I'll, I'll let you know. But if not, I'll um, I'll show you some final reviews, some final installation with all of this, and um, and and that's it. 
I really think that someday it would be great if I can have like a like a camera on top, you know, like the professional YouTuber, so you can see what what's happening here on on the table. But uh, that that will need to that will need to wait perhaps um, sometimes. So uh, okay, I'll put all of this together and then we'll see. We'll yeah, we'll see each other soon. Thanks. So as you can see, I have everything connected right now. Um, the end result it's it's very nice uh, let me walk you through my two monitors are here the kvm is here uh on the table you can see my uh charging just my well anything with the usb c and an usb 3.0 the audio you have it there uh very nice L lcd screen here and then uh, you can just switch between between the the four um, equipment, the, the the four items that you have. I have the laptop here. I have my main computer there, and overall, I am really really happy with the setup. Um, as you can see here, very clean and nice. Well, now everything is ready. Everything is already uh, mounted over here. I show you already um how you can switch between between uh the both both computers um as i mentioned i'm not having a third uh, uh item just yet you know our, our third or a fourth uh thing to connect over here but i'm expecting to to add two more things one it may be one raspberry pi that i have over here and the other uh, is going to be um, probably one of these uh, Super Nintendo Mini or Nintendo Mini. I have them both. I don't have much time to play any of that whatsoever. But the bigger problem is that I'll, I'll never have them connected, right? So I, 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 cannot, I cannot just quick uh, turn it on and start playing for, I don't know, five minutes or 15 minutes, right? Some quick Street Fighter 2 or something. Um, so I'm going to connect one of those that I have into here i have as well an xbox so i might connect that as well just to um uh for 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 the old times playing and uh, but yeah professionally speaking regarding uh the the things that i do with my personal pc and the things that i do with the lap with the uh, work laptop this item is absolutely fantastic things that um that i like i like to mention that this is why uh, i spent it up um some more money to buy in this uh the, the, this specific model is first more room for expansion right like you can add two more um two more items beside those two, those two first uh computers but the other one is about the usb 3.0 which is very very important for uh for me for for performance right you cannot have very nice computers and then have a kvm that it has usb 2.0 that it doesn't make any sense and the other thing as well is the 4k my screens are not 4k right now i know uh but that's that might be that might change in the future right um i might have a 4k bigger screens and then imagine you need to buy a new kvm because uh you know your kvm that is not supporting 4k so this is like a future proof regarding that um and i'm very happy with um uh, with that and finally i know it's very silly right but there in front i really like that it's an usb 3.0 on the front and a usb c as well um to connect some some extra things there on the on the on, on that usb c uh there, there on top so um, on the front that it really stand out out of this model um i hope you like the review very honest very humble here with you you know showing you everything um so if that's so yes you know leave some comments over here maybe leave some comments about how will you do this differently i'm always happy to read uh to read you anyways so just just put it there and i'll give you thumbs up and and, and and let's let's keep the conversation going right that's that's why we're here so thanks for watching the video and speak to you soon cheers bye